All right, so we're going to just talk about Money Heist, the new season. And first, I'm just going to talk, I'm going to recap everyone's memory with the new characters, which is Andreas Palermo. So uh, the last part, like, finished with Lisbon getting captured and they obviously showed the faking of her death. So I'd just like to know, like, what do we all think of the way that was done and how that happened? I think it was muggy. I think that was, that was, to be fair, it's, some of the, it's one of those things I should have seen it coming, but I don't know why my brain never told me. Yeah, that it's, like, it's it. like a surprise when you first see it. You don't expect it. Yeah, and then when you see it, like, I should have expected that because they're not going to kill her off, are they? And plus, at the same time, the guys were still in the bank, weren't, weren't they? Like, yeah. they hadn't escaped yet, and that was a um, Yeah, so, like, um, obviously, I think another important character was uh, Gwendia. So, for people that don't know, he was the bodyguard of the Chancellor. That was one of the hostages. And he managed to escape and then got access to a panic room and everything. Yeah, so, yeah. you guys would agree that like, he's very significant, and he, like, changed yeah. the whole storyline, yeah. isn't it? Well, to be no, honest... No, but you know you're... what? That needed to happen. Like, him so when p was talking to the professor about why he put gwendaya Gwen out is because like p always wants to c take control of the situation like even the professor was saying through the radio to tokyo that p is like the biggest brain they've got apart from him so he needed to take control so obviously everyone was conflicted at the time because you were like why have they blocked p up and then when they got rid of him he also caused like a chain reaction by letting Gwendia go and then Gwendia went on his madness. Yeah. So... Do we all ag do we all agree that Gwendia is like he's a really clever character? Oh yeah, 100%. manipulated everyone. So, yeah. so who would you say is smarter, Palermo or Gwendia? You know, I think with I think Yeah, with Palermo as well, like with the showed with like the flashbacks, the way he built the trust of the professor is to show he was in love with the plan rather than having loyalty as well. Yeah. So rather yeah, than being clever. Also, Helsi yeah. he even said to Helsinki, like, I didn't even think, like, this would happen, as in, like, he didn't think Nairobi would die. Yeah. But then, at the same time, you could argue, you know, the flashback when P was in love with Berlin. That, oh, yeah. that was his personal yeah, effect. Yeah. And, like, what was he actually in love with? Was he actually in love with the plan, or was it because of his past after losing Berlin that like drove him to like be the dominant figure like inside the bank? But I just mm. want to throw something out there. I think Tokyo is a better leader than P. What do you guys think? No, yeah, don't keep Tokyo can no. control our emotions. Yeah, yeah, yeah. She's way yeah. too. But I, I think Palermo is yeah. too unpredictable to lead. Such yeah. a high. So she? Yeah, no, he's, yeah, she's really unpredictable as well. Her emotions. You know what I thought was very smart? Do you know the inside girl that was part of? Oh yeah, yeah, oh, yeah, 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 yeah. The, the transgender. Yeah, 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 the, tra yeah. the transgender. Big up Zainab for that. Was she? Was she know? Denver's? She was Denver's cousin, wasn't she? Or was yes. she Denver's stepsister? Or something? I think. I, I think, think it was cousin first cousin. I think it was cousin. Yeah. yeah. But it was really weird though. You know, it's gone. I was gonna talk about Alicia's character. Oh, bitch. Me. Expand, expand. Oh, okay. Well, do you know what? She's the oh, only wow. one that actually managed to track down where the professor was. But do you know that yeah, had to happen, smart. you feel yeah, me? Yeah, <laughs> I mean, but do you know, the only thing I liked about her was that last line checkmate, motherfucker. That line was. Yeah. Class. That line was yeah. class. That's so underrated. That line. And he's finished on that. Yeah. But do you reckon she will kill him because she knows she's already going no. to prison anywhere? She's gonna I think kill she's anyway. going to go in on it. I, I think she's just... Oh, should we go yeah. into predictions then? What's yeah, happen? I've got yeah, my okay. prediction. Okay, Zainab, you go first then. Okay, so, as I said, I watched this little, like, theory thing on YouTube about Money Heist. And basically, so you know when Berlin gets married to Tatiana... Yes, yeah. uh, Tatiana, yep. Yeah. yeah, like you don't see anything else of her afterwards. Mm. Now, when Raquel asks um, Alicia about her husband, what's his name? No, we don't know. Herman. Oh, is it? Sounds like German. German links to Berlin. Herman, German, Berlin. Did you get it? Didi Herman was German as well from Liverpool. Big I up. think that's a loose <laughs> link. I mean, I could, no. it could be true. It could be true. I think I think Alicia is Tatiana because at the end she sings Chow Bella and the yeah. only people that know the Chow Bella uh, songs are the people that are part of. So she would have. Uh, so you. So what you're saying is that you reckon Alicia's heard Berlin sing 
the child song. That's why she she knows it. Yeah, so I think to... Alicia is Berlin's then, ex-wife. But then surely that makes a lot of sense then because if that was to be the case, Alicia would obviously go in with the plan with the professor because obviously Berlin and the professor were really close. And then, yeah. And another thing is, yeah, it makes sense that why she switched on all her colleagues so quickly as well. Maybe she yeah. wants to get revenge like, just to talk about her plan. She literally ratted them all out. No, but remember how? Well, she 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 was the only one who found the professor, right? But remember in part three when um, uh, the professor got angry at Berlin when they were doing the flashback thing because he told, because Berlin told it. it what was her name? Tassiana or something? Tassiana. Uh, about the plan. Yeah, about yeah. the plan, and he's getting pissed. So maybe but he said he could trust her. Yeah, he said he could. So that's why I think that maybe if that's true, maybe she would be in on I don't think. It. She, oh no, Zainab, you know what? That's you've got actually got a good point because if do you remember how when they I think it was you know when they entered the Royal Mint, that's when Alicia got involved. Do you remember they said there's only one lady for this job, and they got yeah. her involved? Why do you think they got her involved? Maybe she did know about the plan. Yeah. Yeah. But then at the same time, if she knew about the plan all along. They, they would have been caught by now. She would have known every no, step. I think no, but it's not as to... easy. To... You gotta yeah, because yeah, he changes his plan as well. Yeah, the professor I think, I think the professor is too smart. Yeah. The professor is too smart, but yeah. I don't... Zainab, I buy your theory. I think it's, it's very good, but I don't think she'll turn out to be his wife. I think she'll be like, I don't know, a relative. I don't think I don't think he'll be his wife. I mean, I wouldn't be surprised if it's his wife, but... I don't think it, she's done enough and she's shown enough to be his wife just yet. But we have to see how season five pans out, to be honest. We haven't seen much of... It. Yeah, I know what you mean, because we literally haven't seen mm. anything of Tatiana except their yeah. mar- like their wedding. Mm. But then it's just confusing now, because if you just think about... Wait. like, Look, we're left on this cliffhanger for the end of season four, yeah? Like, Alicia's with the professor. They've just... Re- hey, the one Monica. thing I don't like about Money Heist. Is Go all on. the love that happens like Denver fell in love during with it, yeah. with, like, in like three days? <laughs> yeah. Stockholm syndrome. Yeah. Stockholm syndrome. <laughs> no, I do agree. I do agree. It's a bit, it's that that's a bit. But I give them props though because I was saying this to Sukraj like uh, after we first watched it, like they prolonged uh, staying in the bank well, wherever they are for eight episodes. You know they're, they're still there. You feel me? So that's gone over mm-hmm. two seasons now. So, and yeah. they've done it well. It's not like we're, we're getting bored, well. I never got yeah. bored. Yeah. To be honest, I didn't even notice that. You know what I'm saying? Like, we're still, yeah. we're still in the bank, and that's going to roll over to three seasons now. And now it's just going to be interesting where they take it from here, because, like, there's no real opposition in the bank, because, what, look, they've got the undercover, you know, Denver's whatever she is. Mm. Arturo, yeah. he's an idiot. He'll, I think he'll die next season. Oh, and then who else is there? Just the governor of Spain? You, I think that's why it's how well... the... Yeah, go on. Do you know the so one significant thing about significant thing about Berlin is that he's so clever. But he who said it that he doesn't show any emotion. Yeah. There's no emotion. He doesn't show, and yeah. that's what's I think similar to Alicia because you know how she used Nairobi's son against her. Yeah. Yeah. So similarities yeah. between them two. Mm-hmm. I mean, she is confident. She knows what she's doing. You know, when she st- uh, stood in front of the press and was like, "Yeah, we did bury Rio alive." Yeah, and she was almost. I think we forget that she was almost about to crack Raquel. If, mm. um... She basically did. Then did. Um, was his name Alejandro? The guy <laughs> with the watch. And I don't know. I forgot. <laughs> and like... Andreas. Andreas. Yeah. Andreas. And yeah. Something like that. I think that's so clever from the professor. Just everything he does yeah. is just perfect. Yeah, he thinks he thinks so quick. Like the way he thought like, of the, the Paris plan and how that was done, like I straight was, away. I was saying to the guys before, like, just imagine you know, when we're watching Money Heist and some and professors in a sticky situation, like we at home as the audience, are like, yo, what's the professor gonna do? You try and yeah. think, like, what's he gonna do? I do that. I do. I that. Yeah. I did not expect him to release Nairobi's body and then like get um Sukraj, what's his name? Who we went to uh. Where is it? Albania or somewhere? Marseille. Oh, Marseille. Marseille, yeah. Marseille. I didn't expect them to send him there literally within, like, what, two hours and get that guy to confess live. Like, all of that was just amazing. And then that's yeah. the difference between a team. Do you know player, one thing that... that I was really, I was really, like, curious about? Do you know when Tokyo was locked in the secret room? 
Yeah, I was actually I didn't know who was gonna get her out because Palermo wasn't free, if I'm not wrong, and he's the smartest, and I didn't think anyone else could do it. I don't, I didn't think Denver or anyone was actually smart enough to like to find it. Then Denver was leading it. They uh, did. uh, Yeah, but that was with the professor. That to free him at that point. Remember? Yeah. Yeah. Because they were screwed. Because when Rio and Denver were climbing through the vents and Gandio just popping them, they had no chance. Yeah. Yeah, they had to get P out. Gandia was ruthless. Excellent. That's yeah. one thing I'd say. And even when he had a chance to escape, the door was right there. He decided to hide again so he can oh, no. assassinate more of them. Yeah. And then they got the grenade on him. <laughs> uh, do you know? Do you know what was a really clever stunt? You know how they like fast forwarded time from like at the start of the episode. Yeah, yeah. Like, and then they the go yeah. hours back. And then yeah, you're just yeah. thinking, shit, Gandia's escaped. The professor's fucked it. Mm. And then. You see the last episode, and it's like, it's actually all of them just like trolling. It's mad. It's, it's actually mad. so and sick. And you know what is so smart? How they flipped it and got like the police into prison. Yeah. 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 They're three I, steps ahead all the time. I never have seen that coming. Literally. Like, what was the inch of the whole thing built? Six, what was it? 16 meters and 65 centimeters or something. 11 meters and 65 centimeters. Of what? Clock- I remember they built the hole to get... Um, yeah, yeah, yeah. Oh, okay. I can't remember. Sure. But it, everything, you have to be, like, really accurate with that. Mm. In terms of, like, best scene, yeah, the team. I'd, uh, I'd say, like, um, obviously, when they execute, like, Time Paris where they built the wall behind. Well, yeah. What would you guys say in terms of best scenes? I think the best scene was... Um, for me, you know, when Rio and Denver were looking for Gwendea and he throws the grenade into the thingy and they have that massive shoot off in the corridor. Yeah, yeah. There was just so much action. I know nothing happened. Like Rio and Denver were a bit dazed, but the action that went on there was crazy. This shows the power of Gwendea and like how dangerous he actually was. Because at that point, mm. obviously, we were like, what, halfway through the season? And then you're just thinking, shit, Gwendea, this is where it's all going to end. Like, Gwendea is going to finish well. Yeah. He wasn't scared of anything. Like, Exactly. This, to see the fact how we managed it to turn around, it's actually crazy, man. Even when they like spared his life and said, you will survive if you listen to us, he still risked his life to try and kill them. Exactly. At the end. It's mad. But then, what's his name? The guy. Bogota. Mm. Absolutely mashed him up. He, he deserved oh, that. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. I'd say one of the, the scenes where I literally, like, gasped. I think Berlin's the most important character and he's not even here. Me too. Yeah. It's a good job. Yeah. Look yeah. how much they like flashback to him. I'm He's influenced so many things. I know, but that that's where I like I buy your theory though, Zainab, about uh, Alicia being mm. related to him, like his wife, because everything stimulate well, everything basically has stimulated from Berlin, and if they're because basically every character has their own storyline in it, and it all leads back to Berlin and eventually like with the plan and shit, and then. Alicia's gonna have her own storyline and she can't just be a nobody. Like they wouldn't make her that big, like just come out of nowhere because yeah. I mean they could, but it'd just be She'd literally odd. come out of nowhere as well. Exactly, that'd be a bit yeah. odd. Even if so she's far... not Berlin's wife, she's definitely connected to him in some way. Yeah, one hundred percent. Yeah, probably that. But yeah, I, I don't think there, there's something that we're gonna yeah. find out that we didn't know. Yeah. yeah. All all I know, yeah, when season five drops hopefully next year. And then something's revealed. I'm just going to remember this conversation. I'm like, oh, yeah. Zainab. And I if lead. I was right, if I was right. Do you guys want to go on to like, the rest of your predictions then? Uh, I don't mind. You, yeah. you okay, shall I, shall I go with mine? I, I personally think, yeah. I, I don't think she's obviously not going to kill him because that's not going to how it's going to continue. So either he's going to do a madness and escape somehow or she's going to capture him. But I think maybe since she's so deep pregnant, that maybe she might have to give birth like while she's capturing him, like the professor <laughs> help uh, yeah, do it, and then Imagine. that right, way she can about, join the plan. I oh, know, just putting <laughs> out there. That that would be like the cheapest way to kind of get out of that situation, though. That'd be the cheapest way. <laughs> like she just she's how to him? She just has to give birth now yeah. after like Water four breaks. seasons of being pregnant. <laughs> what do you guys think then? It's gonna happen. God, Jay. Me. I already yeah. said, man, I just think she's going to join in on it. I feel like she's going to be like, oh, I want a massive cut, like, if you want to live or something like that. And then, you know, 
Yeah. Although, but I don't, I don't know. Mm. I don't know. Yeah, that seems See, a bit. That, that seems a bit too cliche as well. It seems like they've done that. Mm. Well, no, I don't think they have done that, but it seems like something they would have done already. But so. then at the same time, like you guys would be in agreement with me on this. I think there's not much more you can do in the position they've left us with. It would just be interesting to see what happens inside the bank as opposed to outside mm. because. Obviously, th- there's nothing really, like we said before, there's nothing really to do inside. I think all the action is probably going to take a place outside now. Well, like, guess with what? With Alicia, Alicia's storyline. Yeah, Go on, guess, guess what? I've got another theory. Ah, uh, cool. the floor is yours. So, you know, this could go all the way back to season one, yeah? Does anyone yeah. remember how many high starts? Yeah, but he goes picks yeah, them all up. Yeah, yeah, he, yeah. Find, he finds them okay, all. Okay, but no, no, them. like at the very, very start. When, when he sees the um, Tokyo walking. Yeah. Now you see Tokyo in like a cage thing, in it on the bed. Oh yeah, yeah. Oh yeah. Who's she yeah. with? Who's she with? Who? No one. So my theory is. <laughs> okay. Oh okay. Everybody dies, and she's the only one left retelling uh... her story. Yeah, that would, Tokyo's left. that would piss me off. That would that would actually piss me off. Because she's the reason why, like, they're kind of in that whole situation, anyways. You know, and she's caused so many deaths as well. Yeah, no, it's strange. They had the whole heist to save Rio, and then they've lost more people, and then Rio's not even. Do you think she was right? Rio's an idiot. It as wasn't well, but... Rio's not worth Nairobi and Helsinki's lives. Yeah, no. no, no yeah. Way. For sure. Yeah. Oh, That's why it doesn't make any sense. Hold on. Hold on. Hold on. Yes. 